if you are someone who likes succulent arrangements i'm trying to give you a clear idea about doing a small round pot succulent arrangement this is just an idea you can create your own this is the pot that i'm going to use and it is quite heavy like a kilo heavy and this was 12 dollars from a pot store and i bought this recently and i wanted to do a succulent arrangement if you want to do a succulent arrangement make sure that you put some stones into the bottom of the pot so that way it drains off all the excess water and will not rot the roots of your succulents and i have my succulent soil mix with a bit of scoria cocoa peat and these are actually cut it into small pieces so i use that too so it will hold a bit of water for the plant but it will not rot the roots of the plant now let's do the arrangement i have these tiny little terracotta pots and i filled a bit of soil into it so i'm going to make a hole up here putting the soil to the top and put the pot like this so this will be the front view and this will be the back of the pot so i will turn it again and i can turn it over and show you once i plant it so i want it to be like this in an angle but the bottom side needs to go down and the top side needs to be a little lift up i'm going to use lots of color in it for that i'm using this little Lila Sina that I bought recently and I did the video totally about Lila Sina in another video and I can take a few more leaves because I want the plant to be smaller I think that's enough so I'm going to plant that in here make a hole in the center and put this plant press nicely We have these plants this is echeveria dondo i did another video about echeveria dondo i will write the link in the description box below and it's going to be here and then this echeveria green globe it's a beautiful green plant with nice blue in the middle and going to get that too so the green globe area violet queen and then I have this bin buddies. Now it is ready and I'm going to put it in this corner. Now I have this plant, it's called Echeveria dalidale and it's a cutting